Suzanne Summers, 76, star of Three's Company, Step by Step, and American Graffiti, has passed away after a decades-long battle with breast cancer on Sunday, October 15th, at her home in Palm Springs, California. And we thought it was going to be me because I'm 10 years older. And uh, if that happened, she would be alone which was a terrible conundrum, the idea of her being alone. Summers reportedly spent her final moments with her husband, Alan Hamill, by her side. We were in bed together and her breathing was erratic, and I had been talking to her for hours, her husband told NBC News. Uh, she was heavy breathing at the very end, and I gave her a, a pill to relax the breathing, but it, it didn't work, and I was grateful that I was with her when she left us. There was no response except when I kissed her. She responded, and then around 5 o'clock in the morning, she was gone. From Chrissy Snow on Three's Company to the face of iconic infomercials promoting products like the Thighmaster. And I'm still using it, because it works. Summers and Hamill were married for 46 years. Her family was gathered to celebrate her 77th birthday on October 16th. Her publicist, R. Corey Hay, said in a statement, Honestly, love my age. I love it. I look forward to next year, as long as I can still wear my high heels. <laughs> Instead, they will celebrate her extraordinary life and want to thank her millions of fans and followers who loved her dearly. Summer's son, Bruce Summers Jr., posted a loving tribute to his mother on Monday, October 16th. She soared higher than most can dream. She protected those who didn't have a voice. She asked the questions most didn't know to ask. She shared her challenges and brought light to solutions, he began. When you think it's over, I just want them to know there are more chapters. To so many, she was a brave warrior who articulated their fears. She wasn't fearless, but she faced them so we could learn. She was a friend, a wife, a sister, a daughter, an entertainer, an icon, and a legend, he continued. But to me, she was just mom. I had the privilege as the only person who could call her that. Growing up, it was us against the world, and then she took the world by storm. A pioneer for equal pay for women, Summers was famously fired from Three's company when she demanded the same salary as her male counterparts. I was the first female who asked to be paid parity with men, and I got shot down. She also was an avid health and wellness advocate. Summers was first diagnosed with breast cancer in 2000, and had shared with her fans that her breast cancer had returned in an Instagram post in July 2023. One lesson I got out of it is when you have the impulse to put the railing in, put the railing in. As you know, I had breast cancer two decades ago, and every now and then it pops up again, and I continue to bat it down, Summers wrote in the caption. I have used the best alternative in conventional treatments to combat it. This is not new territory for me. I don't know what I'm supposed to learn from this, but I know it's all part of a big lesson. I know how to put on my battle gear and I'm a fighter. Summers fought until the very end and we wish her family and friends peace during this difficult time.